Hi guys, Brian the Squirrel, I am back with another video and today I have some uh, a little different for you. Let me start out by saying this is not a sponsored video. I actually, uh, I ordered something from a website called Munchpack. Uh, basically it's a monthly subscription service and every month they send you snacks from a different place in the world. So today I'm going to be trying some of these out, yeah. Let's just jump straight into it. Okay, so we've got a little no. It says this month's pack was hand packed with love in beautiful sunny Arizona by Nick. Uh, there you go. So yeah, the, the munch pack we've got is from Arizona. See what we've got. First thing we've got is Al Chipino Peri Peri tortilla chips. Not much of a, well, the chips in America, but we call them crisps. Not much of a fan of crisps, but well, let's have a look. They smell a bit odd, but that's probably just me. <laughs> well, let's have a little taste. They're not too bad. Um, oh, they've got a bit of a kick to them. They basically taste sort of like a mix between barbecue and uh, chili Doritos. It's basically the best way I could describe them. Yeah, not bad, not bad at all. Like I say, basically Doritos. Lovely. Next thing we've got is Pac-Man chocolate, milk chocolate cream sticks. Looking at the box, they basically look like Mikados, if you, if you guys know what Mikados are. I love Mikados anyway, so even the packaging, it looks like Mikados. There we go, let's have a little taste. Lovely, it is essentially just a milk Mikado or whatever they're called. But yeah, delicious. See, a lot of people think I'm boring for this, but just plain milk chocolate, I love it. It's so much better than like your white chocolate, your dark chocolate, your flavoured chocolate, all of that. Milk chocolate's just brilliant. Mm. So yeah, that's the Pac-Man milk chocolate stick things. Okay, this one's a weird one. Now this package was sent from Arizona. But... I couldn't tell you what these sweets are. Well, I can't read it. They look like, uh, I don't know, Chinese or Japanese or something. I have no clue what these are. But that never stopped me before from eating some. I like food, don't judge me. Okay, so they look like little gelatin ball things. They don't really have a smell to them. That, that's what they look like. That is, it's rock solid as well. So I don't think I'm just going to be able to, you know, bite down into this. Go on. Yeah, it's something I have to suck on. Well, it's strawberry flavoured, which I can't see anywhere on this pack. But yeah, it's strawberry flavoured. Ow. It's nice. It's really sweet. But yeah, it's just like a little strawberry strawberry flavoured ball. It's gonna take me forever to get through this. I've just thought of what they're like. Um, if they're from the UK, you'll know about these uh, sweet packs that you can buy. They're like a pound inside it. You get like fizzers, uh, drumsticks, um, Parma violets, love hearts, things like that. And there's one thing you can get in it that's like, it's three or four little rock hard balls. You get them in like different colours, that's essentially what they're like. But yeah, this is... Nim 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 nim. That's all I can call it, nim 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 nim. I like the packaging though. The little ghost, the little, what is it, a little monster and a little lizard. Now I say I'm going to test 
everything in this box. So I'm gonna I'm gonna have to test this, even though I know what it tastes like. We've got a bag of Maltesers. <laughs> I literally sat in a, bo a little box of these last night. I love Maltesers. They're absolutely brilliant. Mm. Mm. I love Maltesers. I, I don't. I'm, I'm having another one. Oh okay. god, they're just fantastic. They're like one of the best chocolates because of the whole. I, I don't know the the crunchiness. Just I think that's the biggest bit that gets me. Mm. But yeah, Maltesers. There we go. Love them. Oh, now I'm looking forward to this one. Uh, for the last one that we've got, it's super. What is it? Sour super dupers. Uh, you see that? I love sour sweets. Anything sour, it's a yes for me. Well, I can't really say that until I've tried it, can I? But the gelatin. Here we go, one minute. There you go, I don't know if you can see that. Yeah, there we go. It says it's going to be sour, so... Getting disappointed here. Really disappointed. Don't get me wrong, the taste is nice. It's like a strawberry jelly sweet. The packaging is so misleading. Sour super dupers. There was nothing sour about that. That that's kind of annoyed me. I was looking forward to a nice sour sweet. I guess I guess I'll just have to deal with it. I was looking forward to that. I like sour sweets. It kind of tasted like the little strawberries you can actually just buy from the shop, just sugary. You know, the little sweet strawberries that are like, what, 5p? I kind of put a dampener on the end of this. Like I say, this is a subscription service that goes on every month, so I'm hopefully going to be doing one of these videos every month uh, from snacks from a new place. So I hope you did like the video. If you did like it, uh, give it a like. Comment down below your thoughts on the video. Uh, subscribe and hit the notification button so that you can always stay up to date on my content. And yeah, I'll catch you in the next one.